Itaha, we're on the Euphrates River right now. Yes. When I go home to America, people always ask me, what do they think about us? So I just ha want to ask you a few questions. Um, first, how many languages do you speak? I speak three languages. Three? And Arabic? Arabic, Turkish, and English. And you, a little French? A little French, yes. Okay. And um, what about uh, how big is your family? Uh, I have uh, five brothers and three sisters, and uh, I have three children. Big family. Yes. I it, have one son and two daughters. What comes into your head when I say the word America? What's the first thing that comes into your mind? First things comes in mind, yes. Power, most powerful country in the world. And what else do you think? Um, just a few thoughts yes, yes. about America. The what you most think. developed country. Advanced country. Oh, advanced. What comes into your mind when I say American food? I was in America for two years almost, and I didn't see anything about American food. I don't know if you have really I say to food. Adair. I don't know if you have. I, I stayed two years there, but I have not tried American food. I don't know if you have American, because when I was there, I, there are many foreigner uh, restaurants. Yes, and when I was there, I used to go foreigner restaurant. I didn't see American kitchen food. Yeah. What? What would Maybe you? Maybe McDonald's. McDonald's. <laughs> That's what you think of when. Yes, yeah. Yeah. This is American food. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, are there a difference um, when people come to Turkey between American visitors and visitors from other countries? They, I, actually, I am. I have, I am guiding most of my guests are from America. Yes, sometimes, uh, rare, I have really from different countries. Yes, and I like to work with Americans. And why? Why, yeah, I think, uh, why they are really, in, the one come to this part of Turkey, really, they are interested in history. Yes, and they are curious to learn about the history of this region, culture, yes, and I like this. Yeah, yes. me too, that's yes. exactly... Uh... Yeah, yes, American, yes, I like that from them, the, this, yes. What is your best advice for people to visit Turkey? Your advice for visitors, travelers to come to Turkey? My advice is, yes, just come to Turkey, just come and you don't have to, pr to prepare for everything, anything and everything here is easy and wherever you go in Turkey for sure people are welcome you yes for sure no matter where you are from people are liking tourists and like to communicate with them yes just you need to travel to Turkey this is a just you travel and you will find your way and everything will be easy let me ask you about safety because I get that question a lot and I think Turkey is really a safe very safe country yes. more so than America yes. easy yes way safer yes. but could you talk about that a little yeah Turkey is really yeah when you are stay a far away from the country and just you watch the TV or you read on the internet this is really you cannot reach the truth yes if you want to see the truth you should go and see it by your eyes and about safety really turkey is 100 percent safe i totally and agree totally, uh, say wherever you go in turkey any region any region any region any city can confirm that it's safe, it's really safe for everyone, for tourists, for local, for any, anyone it's safe. Day or yes. night? Yes, day and night. And you can travel at night, you can drive at night, you can walk at night outside in the street. For sure, it's safe 100%. Okay. Yes, don't uh, hesitate about safety here. I, I totally no, agree. Yeah, there is no hint of dangers in Turkey. None. 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 Yes. And you have been here for almost one month. 
and you I can have. say what you have yeah. seen. And I have. Are, and now we are just we are in east southeastern Turkey, and we are close to Syria border. We I am are. living. I am living only 10 kilometers from the border, mm -hmm. the Syrian border. My hometown is only 10 kilometers from the Syrian border, and we call it Haran. Haran. It is mentioned also in the Bible. The Prophet Abraham lived there 10 years with his wife. Yes, and this town is only 10 kilometers, and I have been there all my life, and there was no, never problem. Even when, 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 was, when there was a Syrian civil war, we didn't have any problem. Any we were problem. living there with my families and other members. Uh, yes, and we have many visitors also to my hometown. Excellent. And then my last question. If you could travel to any place in the world, where would you travel to? I, I like history. I like history, yes, and yeah, really I am interested in history. Uh, I am. I like to go ancient sites. Me too. Yes, yeah. ancient sites. I have not been to Egypt. My next stop for me it will be Egypt, and I am planning to go also to uh, Samarkand. Uh, Uzbekistan. 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 Yes, Uzbekistan. Yes. Uh, I plan to go there. Can I go with you? Yes, for sure. <laughs> you, yeah, for sure. Yeah. <laughs> for sure, yes. Anytime. Okay. Anytime. Th thank you. Thanks, Taha. That You're was welcome. very good. Thank you. You're welcome. Tashi to a there.